Once again, let's hear from Aaron Boone. It is the manager's report brought to you by GEICO. Aaron, is there any indication as to the severity of Garrett Cole's injury? Um, right now, he just, you know, experienced some tightness, so we'll kind of see where we're at tomorrow on it. Um, I know when talking to Garrett, he's, he feels pretty optimistic about it. Um, you know, something that he's, that's popped up before with him, with other pitches, pitchers, just something that he felt like if he was going to push through in there, you know, risk doing something a little bit more. So hopefully it's something that he, you know, got out in front of enough and, and we'll just see where we're at, uh, tomorrow in the, in the coming days. Will he have an MRI? Uh, nothing scheduled as of yet. So we'll see where we're at with him tomorrow and, and see what the next steps are. Did you notice something wrong with him on the mound? Or how did, when did he first kind of complain of a, a possible issue there with the hamstring? Um, I did not. Um, it was actually the McGuire at bat. At the, it might have been a fastball up and in. He felt a little bit something. He kind of, as he got, and when he got through that at bat, he felt like he had to, he, he didn't want to risk, uh, you know, doing something, some, some damage to it. I know you kind of have to wait and see, but do you expect for him to make his next start, or do you think it's we'll a situation? We'll see. I, I think it's yeah. possible. We'll see. I mean, he's he's pretty optimistic in there right now, but we'll just ha honestly have to see how he is overnight and tomorrow and then in the coming days, you know, how he, how he responds. Yep. Brendan Cuddy, please unmute. Aaron, you mentioned how Garrett said this is something he's maybe dealt with a little bit in the past. Does, does he mean this season? I, I think it's just something that I think can pop up with pitchers every now and then. He he felt he had something similar in the in the first half of the season in one of his outings. He was able to kind of work through and not miss a start or anything. So, uh, and, and he feels like it's something similar. But honestly, it's 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 kind of silly for us to sit here and speculate as you know he's still hot from the game. And it's like let's see how he is tomorrow. Are you glad that it seems like he went the cautious route to? Make sure he didn't push it too hard. Or well, absolutely, absolutely. Hopefully, you know, you know, avoided something, you know, more serious. But again, we'll have to see. We can take a next question. Dave Lennon, please unmute. And Aaron, I think from an offensive standpoint, I think that was the first time you guys gone back to back games without a walk or an extra base hit and, and since the, since the 60s maybe um our guys getting you know with the with the offensive struggles getting a little jumpier or maybe getting a little less less patient at the plate or i, I think that's happened at different times i actually thought tonight you know you know in comparison with yesterday i thought we at least put some good swings on balls you know i you know i, I thought for example judge had a few really good at bats and nothing to show for tonight you know voight same way we had some guys that hit the ball okay today compared to yesterday but you know the bottom line is we got to be better you know we're we're we got our guys now and and you know if we're going to be the team we hope to be you know our offense has to carry that freight for us um, and, you know, so we got to get it rolling. <laughs>